Today I'm going to talk to you about what you need to build your own trout line. The first thing that you're going to need is a main line. I like I like to use a nylon, a tarred nylon line, uh, number 36 is for my main line. It's worked really well for me on some really big fish over the years. You're going to need some drop lines, which are the line going from your main line to your hook. For that, I like number 18, and again, it's the tarred nylon line. You're going to need swivels. Depending on how many drops you want, you're going to need one for each drop, and you're going to need some swivels to add in on your main line as well. Uh, for those, I like a two or three alt crane saltwater grade swivel. They've got a really high break strength and that's going to help ensure that your swivel doesn't fail you if you do get a chance to hook up with a really big catfish. Uh, the next thing that you're probably going to look at needing are hooks, of course. Uh, you can go whichever style you want to. Myself, I prefer the, just a J style hook, anywhere from a six alt up to an eight alt for flatheads. If I'm targeting smaller catfish, like channel cats, I'll go down as low as a number one sometimes, uh, depending on what I'm targeting. And for the, another, another handy item for everything that you're going to need, there's some, uh, there's some clips in there. They make a trot line clip, and that's handy for a couple, couple reasons. One, put your tags on there for legality purposes. Two, if you want to attach weights and such, you can use them for that as well. And if you want to use them to attach your hooks, you can use those as well, along with your swivels. And clip those on the main line. Another uh, convenient thing when you're doing your own trot line is you need something to wind it up on. They make a line winder. You can pick these up at some of your local convenience store, like a Walmart or something. Just makes it easy on you. You can wrap it up on any other, like a, a board or anything else that you can want to wind your line around. Something to keep it neat and organized. And that's the bare essentials that you need to build your own trout line.